Here's my take of my analysis on the fight. Terrence Crawford has just been dominating everybody. And you know, he's been active. Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Bobby D coming to you from Palombon, Cebu, Philippines. Having an awesome time in the Philippines today. Hope you are as well where you're from. Hey, today, I want to ask for those of you that are here for the first time, that you would click on the subscribe button and the bell notification icon. So you can continue receiving fresh, new Philippine videos, motivational videos, and worldwide videos. Hey, today I'm going to be talking to you about Terrence Crawford versus Amir Khan fight predictions from the Philippines. Terrence Crawford versus Amir Khan by prediction from the Philippines. Yeah. <laughs> All right, my friends, we're going to jump off into this one right now. The fight will take place in Madison Square Garden in New York on April 20th. What time will the rain walks be? Rain walks will be expected to take place after 10 p.m. Eastern Time. What channel or TV will it be on? The fight will be broadcast on BT Sports Box Office and UK as pay per view. ESPN Plus will broadcast the fight in the US also on pay per view. Okay, here you see the stats for the tail of the tape. Both fighters are uh, relatively s the same in most categories. Uh, the, no the most notable category is the KO percentage, which Crawford is 74% versus Khan 54%. And the other height advantage would be to Khan. Here's my take of my analysis on the fight. Terrence Crawford has just been dominating everybody. And you know, he's been active, only fought twice in 2018 and twice in 17, 2017. But you know, I, I don't think that's a big deal. But I do think that he's pretty much in shape most of the time when it comes to fight. Uh, Crawford's last two fights, he fought uh, Jeff Horn, of course, he took the belt from Jeff Horn, and he fought Benavides. Jeff Horn was pretty much manhandled by Crawford the entire fight. Benavidez, on the other hand, uh, pretty much gave Crawford a run for his money. Now, on the other hand, Amir Khan, I don't care what anybody says, that knockout that Canelo gave him, I don't think he was ever wants to see that or to feel that again. He was also knocked out by Danny Garcia. Of course, you know by stoppage. But I know, I mean, timing to speed. You know, Amir Khan, he's, he has speed. But Terrence Crawford has time. He's got all the tools, and he's just a dog, man. Like, Terrence Crawford has to fight a top fighter. So Crawford's like, he's like a dog, and he's going to be fighting another top fighter just like him. So when Crawford gets hit, he, gets, he comes back at you that much harder. And so it's going to be a heck of a fight. And, and what I like about it is that that uppercut that he hit on Benavidez, oh, man. That was a work of art. He, that was a work of art. And he set it up perfectly. Amir Khan had, a, had an opportunity to fight Kell Brook. He, he turned it down. Because he wanted to go try to get a bigger payday with Crawford. The one detriment to him, he's got a glass chin. And everybody knows it. And that's what Crawford is probably going to try to exploit. Uh, Amir Khan usually starts out fast. And he slows up around the fourth to the sixth round. So we'll see what happens. If Crawford can take advantage of that, it may be uh, not good for a con. All right, guys. My prediction for this fight, I'm predicting Terrence Crawford, Terrence Bud Crawford to knock out 
Amir Khan in the sixth round. Yeah. Uh huh. Because the glass chin has to be tested. And guess what? Terrence Crawford's gonna test it out. Again, my prediction Terrence Crawford, KO, sixth round. Question for today Who do you think will win this fight? Leave your comments for me in the comment section of this video. And as always, remember to like, share, and subscribe. This is Bobby D saying take care, God bless, and peace. Towering presence, run like the wind. Be a king or a queen. Life in the Philippines.